Welcome back. I thought it would be useful to talk about the software that will be our trusty companion for the rest of the course. We'll take a closer look at the origins of Cloud Compare, explore its powerful functionalities, and I'll even share some recommendations to help you get the most out of it. Cloud Compare was started in 2004 during Daniel Girardot Montau's PhD at EDF Research and Development. Its initial purpose was to detect changes quickly by comparing terrestrial laser scanner point clouds. In 2009, Cloud Compare became open source with version 2.1, and in 2023, Daniel is still leading the development with the help of contributors. Cloud Compare has the ability to handle any type of point cloud, including airborne terrestrial, structure for motion, and sonar. It also runs on multi-OS platforms, including Windows, MacOS, and Linux. The core software and plugins are developed by contributors and organizations. Originally, as I said, Cloud Compare was designed to perform direct comparison between dense 3D point clouds and it relies on a specific octree structure that enables great performance when performing this kind of task. It was meant to deal with huge point clouds on a standard laptop, typically more than 10 million points, which is considered huge in 2005. Since then, many other point cloud processing algorithms have been added, including registration, resampling, color normal vectors, color fields management, statistics computation, sensor management, interactive or automatic segmentation, and more. Display enhancement tools such as custom color ramps, color and normal vectors handling, calibrated pictures handling, open GL shaders, plugins, etc. are also available in Cloud Compare. It's a versatile 3D point cloud processing software that can handle a lot of file formats for input and output, making it easy to visualize and process any type of 3D point cloud. Additionally, it has GPU display and rendering capabilities, which allow faster and more efficient processing. One of the most significant features of Cloud Compare is its ability to compare point clouds, which includes measuring changes, distances, and volumes. This feature is useful for a range of applications, from environmental monitoring to quality control and manufacturing. Cloud Compare also provides users with rendering, visualization, and animation tools making it easy to create and share 3D visualizations. Additionally, there are many plugins available for advanced functions, such as Cloth Simulation Filter, Ransack, Poison Reconstruction, and more. For advanced users, Cloud Compare also offers support for Python integration and automated processing through a command line interface. This feature enables users to write and execute Python scripts that automate repetitive or complex tasks. Finally, it's worth noting that Cloud Compare also supports mesh, polygon, and other data types. This allows users to work with a variety of 3D data and easily integrate Cloud Compare into their existing workflows. As you know, when working with point clouds, the hardware requirements can vary depending on the size and complexity of the data. In this video, we'll be discussing the hardware recommendations when using Cloud Compare. For small point clouds with visualization, Typically containing around 20-30 million points, a standard laptop will suffice. However, to ensure smooth performance, it's recommended to have a dedicated graphics card and at least 8 gigabytes of RAM. For larger point clouds with visualization containing around 100-200 million points, more powerful hardware is necessary. A CPU with a large number of cores is required since Cloud Compare is fully paralyzed. Additionally, a dedicated gaming graphics card with large memory, greater than 8 gigabytes, and at least 32 gigabytes of RAM is recommended. To ensure fast storage, an SSD drive is also recommended. If you're planning on processing large point clouds in batch mode with command line operations, then a multi-core CPU, lots of RAM, greater than 64 gigabytes. Also, an SSD drivers are necessary. A graphics card, on the other hand, is not required for this type of operation. Keep in mind that these are just recommendations and that the actual hardware requirements will vary depending on the size and complexity of the data you're working with. With the right hardware, however, Cloud Compare can be a powerful tool for visualizing and processing point cloud. Great job! Before we wrap up, I want to remind you that Cloud Compare is a completely free and open source software. 
So if you found it useful, you can always make a donation to support the development of this amazing tool. In the next video, we will explore how to download and install Cloud Compare, as well as a brief overview of the user interface. Remember, the best way to master any software is to use it actively and practice.